this one's been around for a while, but I use it quite often when I need to make a whole series of objects. So I'm gonna make just a, a first object and then make a second one that's gonna be the actual object that I want to rotate. So I have that one selected, I go to my rotate tool and I thank goodness for smart guides because it's showing me there's the center. So I hold down the option key or alt key and double click and it comes up with this dialog box and it says, how much would you like to rotate it? Well, I'm not good at mathematics. So, I mean, I suppose I could pull up my calculator and say, well, I want seven objects, so a circle is 360 divided by seven. So again, just let Illustrator do it. Copy. Anytime you make a copy, and I will change this so it'll, it'll display a little better in a second. Anytime you do any kind of transformation like copy, there's a, if you don't know any other shortcut ever in Illustrator, learn this one. Command or Control D for transform again. What the, the way I think of it is transform again means whatever you just did, do it again. So I rotated a copy this exact angle. Now every time I press that shortcut, it just does exactly the number for me around the outside. Okay. So the first step was I let Illustrator do the math so I didn't have to figure out what angle I should rotate it. But just to be aware that this transform again command, honestly guys, it's just such a useful command. So for example, let's just say I wanted to have a series of squares across the page as a design element. So I have the first one, I'm just going to hold down uh, I've got my rectangle tool, so I've got command or control for the uh, selection tool, option or alt to make a copy, and then I hold down shift, and I move it that far. Now, I have no idea how far that is. I didn't look at the measurement. I didn't say, oh, it's exactly, I just said, visually, I want it that far apart. Now, I want more of them. Command or control D will do the same thing. So it's copying, moving, rotating, any transformation you do, transform again literally means whatever you just did, do it again and again and again. So it can be used in lots of different ways that are really very interesting. 